what's good agent of chaos back at batman arkham origins in the last episode we were hunting the penguin and we got one of his henchmen to give us a location that's where we're headed off to now so let's get into this let's do it had a doctor's appointment today um my finger is well it's there there's uh a little bit of cause for concern. But don't you think it's weird? We've never seen this guy or heard his The voice. doctor um, is a little concerned because in the last week um, I've had a lot more pain than usual. And hold on. Let me kick these guys' asses. And that's how you do that. Uh, yeah. So my finger has uh, been keeping me up at night. Um, a lot more pain than usual. Um, so she uh, she put me in a lot of pain today, to say the least. Um, well, come on, select it. Not so easy when you've got to use. Uh, make sure that I don't have. Okay. Brains. She cleaned it. And then, um, Typical. I mean, what like, uh, she took off all the dead skin, which is, which is kind of disgusting. It. it is inverted, for fuck's sake. Kind of disgusting. Why can't I do this? Really? There we go, slow it down. So she got it all clean, uh, she took off all the dead skin, and then my finger is extremely black, and that was one of the things that she was most concerned about. Um, so she sent me for uh, an x-ray to make sure that my bone is healing, which, not so much. My finger, the bone in my finger is still very broken. It, uh, it hasn't healed 100%. I'm about... Uh, I'm about 65% there, she said, or somewhere in and around there. Congratulations are in order. Maybe you're not as stupid as Uh, so yeah. Why are you doing this, and Nick? So after my my X-ray and she cleaned it up, she didn't like how black it is. So she said, "I'm gonna send you for a tissue sample because it doesn't look like an infection. It looks like something else." And she wouldn't tell me what it was. Um, I don't know if that was just kind of give me peace of mind or. To be honest with you, I would have much rather her just tell me what it was, but she didn't. And she sent me for a tissue sample, and essentially what they did was they cut out a scab, the scab in my finger, because it was the blackest. They cut that out without any freezing. Yeah. Um, I, I Like, I was sitting there, and I asked her, I asked the, the SIM card I took nurse or doctor or whatever communication. she was, if she was going to freeze me, and she's like, no, it's not going to hurt all that much. And I was like, uh, I'm pretty sure it's, it's going to, because you're, you've got a scalpel in your hand. Penguin's pretty pissed off about the deal going south. And, uh, she's like, no, you won't feel a thing. It's all good. Alfred. And 30 seconds later, I've experienced the most pain I have ever been in in my life. Yes, I see it here. There was, uh, there was no gentleness to it uh, it was kind of she just dug right in with the, uh, with the scalpel and then with a pair of tweezers and just kind of ripped it off it it, it hurt like a fuck -er. it hurt so bad I, I, like I said I have never been in that much pain in my life you know my finger is extremely sensitive as is 
and then for somebody to just say, hey, we're going to start ripping stuff off of it, and it's not 100% healed, it, oh, it, it's, it's just bad. I've, uh, I've had a headache ever since. Like, it's just, it's ridiculous, the amount of pain <laughs> that I had to go through today. And for them not to freeze it, just, you know, no, we're going to take this scalpel and these pair of tweezers and... And, uh, we're just gonna kind of hope for the best. Yeah. So, I've got to wait, uh, four days or something, um, before the test results come back. And that will tell them, uh, everything they need to know, I guess. Um... It's it's a very long process, and I didn't think it was going to take this long. Obviously, I knew that it was going to take some time. But to go from one doctor's appointment where they say, yeah, you're doing absolutely fine, you've got nothing to worry about, to two weeks later, uh, now there you might have something to worry about. I don't know. It's... It's... it's it's played a lot of tricks on my mind, for sure. For sure, it's played a lot of tricks on my mind. You expect me to believe that? And... I need to find the next comm station. Then I'll be able yeah, to try and get the penguin's position. Then mess with our shipment. Yeah, I don't... It's, uh... So next time you want it's something that... I didn't ever expect to happen to me. Uh... And as I said before, it was just a freak accident. Like, the, there was nobody at fault. Mr. Cobblepot, I swear it was the bad. He dropped Ricky off the roof of the clock tower. It just kind of, it happened, and it sucks, but here we are. If you're not back here, we're So I guess now the, uh, the only thing to really do is just wait it out and hope to God that there's nothing serious going on. Um, every time I go into a doctor's appointment, she tells me, yeah, don't forget, you are going to be losing that fingernail. And I got to see my finger today, and I hate looking at the fucking thing, I really do. But it's, it's kind of like a car crash. Uh, you don't want to look, but at the same time, human nature, you just, you, you have to. So, Potential assignment incoming. Keep this channel open. I've wrapped my head around the fact that it'll never be and look the same as it did before. I've come to terms with that. It is what it is. And, like, the sensations that I have in my finger, like, uh, whenever she went to clean it today, it felt, like, it hurt, but it felt weird. An encrypted data drive. Like, extremely, extremely weird. If I can collect it. And I don't know if it's because I haven't... Well, I mean, it's it's been wrapped up and in a sling, or in a, in a splint now for almost a month. So, I mean, it's, you know, I haven't touched anything with it. So, I guess there's, there's that. But yeah, it, it felt really, really weird. Sensation that I have, I have never felt before. Uh, let's drop a smoke pellet. about the finger um i've been dancing around the idea of maybe starting a another series um if you guys haven't checked out the video from yesterday uh multiplayer monday go ahead and check that out but i've been thinking about doing another one and this one uh is kind of like a uh i'm a big movie buff i love movies if uh, you've watched any of my other videos, you know that I was supposed to go to film school and it didn't end up happening. Blah, 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 blah. Um, so I've been thinking maybe, you know, I start another series. Uh, where the fuck am I supposed to go? Isn't this where I'm supposed to go right here? Just use this and do the signal jammer thingy. Oh, 
No? Okay. Oh, there you guys are. I've been waiting for you. Where you been? Eh, we're not gonna do that. Let's just kick his ass. You're done. So yeah, a movie review series, I think, and I'm going to try it out right now. Now, beware, spoilers inbound. If you haven't went out and seen this movie, mute the audio right now, because I'm going to let it all spill. Uh, I recently, and by recently, I mean 10 minutes before I started recording this video, I recently, oh, well, I just finished watching... Independence Day Resurgence. I am not one to bash movies without a very good reason, and this movie has quite possibly the best reasons for it to be bashed. Uh, to me, they're just they were just trying to cash in on something that was so good, and I'm gonna be honest with you, it, the movie sucks. It is by far the most ridiculous piece of shit movie and I say that not very often about movies because usually when people say that movies are shit that just you know I go ahead and I, I watch them and you know oh yeah okay it wasn't that bad yeah sure it could have improved here and it could have improved there but I don't think there was any improving this movie I really don't and it is a very good thing that Fox didn't uh, agree, I'm gonna die, agree to Will Smith's $50 million payday for two movies. Uh, because this to me compares to Wild Wild West. And what we all know that Wild Wild West was just a very, very shitty movie. Oh, it's a real shame, you dead. It's a good thing that they You're didn't, because it just would have hurt Will Smith even more. <laughs> uh, like I said, they were trying. they're trying to cash in on the original. And the original was awesome. And nine times out of ten in Hollywood, sequels never do as well as the film that comes before them. I mean, there are some exceptions. Terminator 2, Aliens. Uh, that's just two right off the top of my head. I'm a huge James Cameron fan, so... Are you fucking serious? Gotta be kidding me! He's real!
No more. <sighs> Don't come any closer. Got that done. Thank God. What are you doing? Get down! You wanna get cut, Batman? Looks like someone brought a bat to a knife fight. Let's, uh... some kind of fighting tournament. That's where I need to go. Okay. Let's, uh... Only way to go is this way? Let's go this way. I'm gonna go to the fight club. Right. My cousin was using these in a war. Hey, guys. <laughs> That's right. That's what I thought. All available hands aboard the SS4. Engine room starting to flood. Be pumped out. Pronto. Hope I'm going the right way. I can't remember. I think I must be. Now they know I'm here. They don't know who he's dealing with. Hey, listen up. I can't have this shit. Wipe the street with him. Fight, but you charge at me. Right, so I came in that way. Ah, here we go. Oh, 
pull. There we go, we're flying now. I don't want to go this way. Oh, come on, ladies! Better keep your dressing. All right, lads. The rest of you losers to me are going to have to embarrass Fox. yourselves without me. God knows you're going to have to go around. I've got some business to take care of in the office, and I don't want to be disturbed. Tracy will be running the fights till I get back. Sounds like Penguin will be in his office. Tracy should know where that is. I'll make her talk. Shit, I fucked it up. Crusher larynx, what's it going to be? All right, all right. Uh, he's in his office. Only way in is through the theater on the other side of the casino. But you'll never get past Tracy. Tracy is not a problem. That worked better than the last interrogation. That's it. As all YouTubers say, smash the thumbs up, drop a comment. If you are new around here, go ahead, hit the subscribe button. The reason you want to do that, upload brand new videos every single day. 
In the description, you will find my Twitter, my Twitch, my Xbox Live, and my PSN Gamer Tag. Something specific that you would like to see me do here on the channel, drop me a line. If I can get it done for you, I will. Having said all that bullshit, I am Agent of Chaos, and I'm out.